Hey guys, what you saw just now is shot with the Case Reflex Lens 200mm f5.6. The biggest difference between this reflex lens and most camera lens in the market is utilizing the principle of light retracement in photographing. The difference of light retracement lies in the defocused image effect it produces. It creates a special and distinctive donut bokeh effect that could only be produced by a reflex lens. The existing reflex lenses are expensive and big with a small aperture and the cheaper ones result in poor image quality. However, my first impression of the case reflex lens is built solid and high quality with very nice texture. In this video, I'm going to share with you three tips on how to take beautiful images and create the donut bokeh effect with case 200mm f5.6 reflex lens. First of all, this lens has an aperture of f5.6 with manual focus. Tip number one is we need enough space due to the 200mm focal length. Therefore, when planning your shoot, choose a location with enough space and lighting. Choosing a spacious outdoor area with sufficient lighting sources would help us to get better images. The reason we need to create distance between the background and subject is to achieve great depth of field for the bokeh effect. Additionally, we will need sufficient lighting, particularly if our background has light shining through it, as this lens may produce better results. Tip number two is focusing. Most of the current cameras have autofocus. When it comes to manual focus, it is recommended to use the focus assist function. The way I do it is through zooming in the live view, then turn on focus peaking. Focus peaking highlights peak contrast areas with a false color overlay in your viewfinder. When you focus successfully, red lines will appear around the focus subject. This can help you determine what part of the image is in focus before you shoot. A side note, before focusing on your subject, rotate the focus ring to make the subject out of focus. Then gradually adjust the focus until the subject is in focus. Tip number three, stability is essential when shooting with this 200mm reflex lens. It is pretty sensitive, even if you just shake a little. So I would recommend turning on your camera's built-in stabilization function if you shoot without a tripod. To get better results, I personally prefer using a monopod or tripod for assistance. Using a monopod is more flexible for moving around, especially for video shooting. I also do handheld sometimes to create a more casual artistic atmosphere. In conclusion, I think the Case Reflex lens brought new and exciting experiences, especially when used in video shooting, adding a romantic element to the footage. I have to admit, many cameras and lenses are automatically set up and ready for use. Even though the case reflex lens is manual focus, once you master the use of it, it allows you to enjoy photographing even under limited conditions. This is something more interesting and fulfilling to shoot with compared to auto lenses. Again, I appreciate Case for creating this reflex lens.